Good afternoon. I'm Mike Peterson, and here's the latest from the KMA Newsroom on this Wednesday afternoon. Page County starts the year 2023 with an opening on the Board of Supervisors. In a release Tuesday afternoon, 3rd District Supervisor Chuck Morris announced he had submitted a letter of resignation to County Auditor Melissa Wellhausen with a resignation effective as of 829 this morning. First elected in 2016, Morris won a second full term to the board in 2020. Morris cites increasing rhetoric and vitriol as reasons for leaving. A committee consisting of well housing, county recorder Brenda Esaias and county treasurer Angie Dow will select Morris's replacement. Our Ethan Hewitt talked to Melissa Wellhausen about that process. We'll have a story online and later on on KMA News this afternoon. From barbecue competitions to 4th of July events to vendor fairs, the Forum to Revitalize Shenandoah once again made its presence felt in 2022. For its efforts, Shenandoah's Valley News recently made the organization's members its People of the Year for 2022. Forum Committee members Stacy Truex and Amanda Schneiderman recapped the year just ending and looked ahead to 2023 in an interview on KMA's Morning Line program this morning. Montgomery County officials received an update on the proposed plan and funding sources for a long-discussed bridge replacement project. During its regular meeting yesterday morning, the county's Board of Supervisors heard from County Engineer Karen Albert, who outlined the timeline for replacing the 250th Street Bridge, or the Beacon Bridge, west of G Avenue over the East Nishnaponta River. And a KMA land native who flew an important space mission in the 1960s has passed away. Former astronaut Walter Cunningham died Tuesday in Houston at the age of 90. A Creston native, Cunningham flew aboard Apollo 7 in 1968. It was the first crew test of the Apollo system that eventually took astronauts to the moon. We have a story remembering Walter Cunningham online at KMALand.com. KMA on track weather. Cloudy with a high in the lower 30s this afternoon. Mostly cloudy tonight with lows in the low 20s. Mostly cloudy then sunny tomorrow with a high in the lower 30s. More news at 12.05 and 1.05 this afternoon in 5.05 and 6.05 this evening and online at KMALand.com. For KMA News, I'm Mike Peterson. So long, my friend.